So just wanted to show you what I have going on here. So we'll go to the camera. I have my Mavic with a remote controller tied to the phone. And I have the TV up and running with the Chromecast. So let's exit the camera here. And we'll go to the Google Chrome app. Because I'm on Android, I can cast to the screen. So now, what's on the cell phone is on the TV. I'll just show you that with the camera again. That is the cell phone on the screen. So now let's just turn the controller on, which loads the DJI Go 4 brand new app automatically. And I'm seeing that on my screen perfectly. And now I'm going to turn my uh, drone on. There's the startup sound for the drone. You see I can connect now. And there is uh, everything for the drone. With some warnings, of course, because I'm inside. The home point has been updated. Please check it on the map. Still got G good GPS, apparently. So the screen is recording because I have an Android device. I can move the gimbal up and down. And let's record. So now we're recording with the drone. So I can use the drone to show you that everything is on the TV. So the drone is on the TV through the Chromecast, on the phone, connected to the controller. Just pan down a little bit. Now you can see that the controller is hooked up to the phone, which is wirelessly sending to the TV. Just stop that recording. That recording stopped. Do the gimbal up. And as you can see, everything is working on the TV. A lot of interference here because we're in the house and there's a lot of Wi Fi boosters and signals. But um, this is absolutely uh, the most awesomest way to use your Mavic is with an Android device.